So here is one of my secret vintage uh, flea markets. As a stylist, I have to find some really cool places to buy cool stuff because we're always looking for great props. So I have a bevy of places in this area that I go to. I mean, to be honest, I, I really like to come here by myself because I don't really like to share all of my secret haunts. But if you're coming on a shopping retreat, you're gonna come here with me and to some other fantastic places that I'm not even gonna take my crew to because they're so secret. Okay, I'm done talking to you because I'm seeing some things that I really love. So one of the places I'm taking you to, I go all the time. Like I go almost once a week. They know me well. You know, they're, they're very kind. I've been doing this for so long that I like ignore all the junky stuff and I just see the really fabulous stuff. And so when people come with me shopping, I kind of show them how to do that. So we're gonna go in, into the outer part that's got more of the furniture first. I am looking for a little table for my guest room. This is so cute. This is so cute. 35 euros. All right, so this is a maybe. It gets so excited. Oh, this, this is a great table. Look at this table. Michael, look at this table. Oh, do you think it folds up? That? Yeah. Probably. Oh my God. I love this table. Such a great table. All right, this is a possibility. 30 euros. Hello. Oh, I love this. This is great. So, so this is a great piece. Here's the issue. I don't think it could be cleaned to the point where you would, and it doesn't have like a great, like, it's dirty, but not in the good way. Like it doesn't have good patina. Okay, back it up people. And don't fall down. Oh, now they tight don't. Tight spaces. Oh, well, that's, that's a flea market for you. It's a tight space. Yeah, it's a really great bed. That is really, really cute bed. So when you buy these beds, you're like, oh, I love this bed, this is so great, cute twin bed. The problem is, is that these old beds are narrow, so you have to have a mattress made for them. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. I had an old iron bed uh, that was beautiful that I had to get rid of because we just could never get it to not jiggle and make a lot of noise. And I mean, I think that makes people really nervous in a guest room when they're like moving around and you know, the headboard's just like banging away and... <laughs> the oh. owner is not Ooh. very happy. Maybe. He asked me to tell you not to film or to ask for permission. Oh no, I buy from her all the time. Yeah. Ciao. Oh, okay, no problem, we'll stop. Seriously, are you f***ing kidding me right now? All of a sudden, Claire, who runs one of the cameras, sort of peeks around the corner and says, somebody wants to talk to you and I'm literally, um, I'm literally approached by this woman I've never seen in my life. And um, I'm assaulted essentially by this woman. So I tried to calm them down as much as possible. Full disclosure, I mean, I buy like tons of stuff from these people. I bought the table anyway, cause why not be sweet? And I'm gonna go back there again anyway. I like getting kicked out of places though, actually. Like when do you get kicked out of some place? Like never. As you get older, no one's kicking you out. So it was kind of fun. I used to get kicked out of bars all the time, so. Oh. oh, this is one of my favorite places. One of my favorite vendor vendors is the husband wife team. They're totally adorable. Ciao, buongiorno. This is my friend, Deborah. She speaks pretty good English. See? No. See, okay, no. <laughs> no. 
but her and her husband own this fantastic flea market. She is one of the first people that I met when I was doing my house. I have bought many things from her and her husband. So she's gonna give us a tour. Follow us and don't fall down. Down into the bowels. Io detto a Peter l'altro giorno. Sì. Che se tu venivi qui, mm -hmm. facevi tutte foto, mm -hmm. più caos c'è, più tu amazing. <laughs> per lui piace questo. No, a te piace tutto caos. <laughs> Io sì, sì, sì. She said I like chaos. I do like a particularly crowded junkie, you could die at any moment, something could fall down and kill you type of situation, like, you know. Uh-oh. Okay, so I don't know if the cameraman can fit through here. Okay. Oh my God, there's so many fabulous things here. I'm gonna get lost. So I think a lot of these things come out of houses where people have like, <coughs> and so then they, because sometimes they have like just stacks of plates and stuff. Um, we don't talk much about that though. This is totally my candy store, just so you know, like this, this is, you never see me look like this. My husband would say that too. <laughs> I never look this excited. This part of the, is their showroom where things are more finished. This is cool. I love it. Okay, this, I've never seen this. Questo non è normale questo. Come no? Perché io non visto questo? I mean... Il latta. Latta per... 1920, il periodo. E faccio pipì. No, pipì. No, no, cooking. <laughs> per me, grazie mille. It's fantastic. I've never seen, I've never seen one like that. So if you're looking for these kinds of old sinks, everybody always asks me, where do you get your old sink? I got my old sinks from them. They're sort of all around. There's like a bunch of them over here. And um, they're great to use when you do renovation as, you know, here and they're not particularly expensive. They have a lot of doors. A lot of people like to retrofit and upcycle doors. So they have tons of doors. Sometimes a door is a very cool table. So if it has no hardware on it and it has a great pat patina, they will make it a table for you, which is why they're so cool. They did so much stuff at our house, it was, it's crazy. But they do have fun outdoor things. Oh wow, having a problem. You know, I really like those. I think I'm gonna get those because I think I'm gonna hang them on the house. Me and my pot. It's not a chamber pot though. It'll fit, right? Let's squash the camera there, it's all good. If you're coming to a shopping retreat, this is sort of what you can expect. It's lots of fun. They're great. And um, we're going to send you home with lots of fantastic finds. Don't ask me where I'm shopping when you write below in the comments. Don't ask me because I'm not going to tell you. I've been a stylist for 30 years. It's a secret. All right. So um, while you're looking at this, don't forget to subscribe below. Hit that bell if you want. My newest video! What do you think of my new table that I bought the flea market for 30 euro? Yes, please. The thing about this that's cool is that you can fold it up and take it outside. Okay, now we're gonna finish off our little display here with my um, soup pot. We're probably not gonna pee into it, but we're gonna just display it here. This was five euros, this was 30 euros. This is what I love about the flea markets around here. So thanks for vintage shopping with me, scouring the flea markets here in the Linijana. Um, happy shopping.